Hey everyone, it's Starkiller, and we're back in our Star, Star Wars playthrough. Last time we had our first war against the Trade Federation to bring them as part of our empire. We'll be ready to integrate them shortly, but uh, yeah, we've got some few things to sort out first. There appears to be contact scenario over Camino. Not sure what is down there, because I can't actually see what's in the system, so we'll have to send an envoy to check it. Uh, I'll have to send this one for the time being because I want to get the Corelli one up for reasons that we need to conquer their system as soon as we can. Hopefully try to push them away from the Boffin clans. There are, I think the clans are a bit more powerful so they do have a, a proper shipyard there so must be cautious from that. So, but uh, Okay yeah we've got another Ascension Perk thing done so that's good. We'll be able to Get a new thing. I'm not sure what we should get. Force projection. Maybe there's something about stability on planets that will help me with that world that has the virus on it, unfortunately. I don't think so. There is. Administrative capacity, just empire size, edicts, leaders, and the stuff, sensor range. I don't. No, nah, sensor range is alright at the moment. Research speed, possibly. Fighter damage. Naval capacity, I might do. Starbase influence. Claim influence. I might do that, so that we can claim stuff easily, actually. But there does not appear to be any other stuff. Um, okay, we'll get the Dominion then. Because we'll start claiming the worlds from the Carillions and the older on and that soon. Once we are prepared for war. But stability is going all incredibly down because of uh, the lowest. I mean, there's nothing I can do with the epidemic. It's really going to come and cost me, that is. So. But there's just nothing I can do. And there's kyber crystals that we could harvest down there. But, yeah, I've had to put it under martial law, so there's not many growth. So, I don't know what to do about this world, to be honest with you. We'll just have to probably prepare for an uprising on it. There's literally nothing I can do about it. There's no sign or no thing to remove it. So the new ship upgrades have been installed. I've got no clue. I'm gonna dismantle the equipment from that terraforming thing. Imperial scientists have research this. Computer component cast and upkeep. Unlock generic. I might as well just get the tile remover, but yeah, it'll be busy at the moment. But yeah, we'll have to prepare for some sort of backlash of Typhon. <sighs> I'm so glad that I missed that. That's really gonna hurt, isn't it? But yeah, we're planning. The next worlds we'll need to conquer is the Carillion Security and the Kingdom of Alderaan just to secure our core selves because they would probably be a part of the rebellion if it comes to fruition. I'll form a defensive pact with... Oh, I can't, because it requires excellent relations. They're receptive at the moment, so... Mm -hmm. It's possible. I could really do with more envoys, actually. I could really do with more envoys. But yeah, the spy the networks office. must be improved here. Hopefully we can try and like disrupt them um, their relationships with the Boffin clans if possible. With them out of the picture, we won't have to worry too much when we declare our war on them. It's just the Boffin clans I'm a bit unannounced. Is that bright council? Hmm. Fair enough. Okay, encryption is up. That's good news. So, 
Drive to shop to... Secret Imperial project is complete. Credits. Monitor. Man, we are not getting any good stuff. That's the social security we're on TIE 4 resident node. Of a guy. That's just... Uh, TIE 4 was just really not going well. It's not good, not good on Typhon, it's not good at all. I think the only worst case scenario is that Typhon may re become uh, re rebel forces and we may have to move in to re-secure the planet. I've done everything I can to try and get it back up, but it's not going to do anything. Imperial scientists have new advancements to show us. God, we've got terraforming already, that's brilliant. I suppose we can, like, terra. Oh no, we're not. We have to. No, terraforming is the first thing, that's fine. The forces over Camino are hostile, are they? I wonder if they're the, um. No, that wouldn't be the pirate base over Camino. That'd be weird. Trade protection. Oh, trade protection. I'd have to vote with that, I'm afraid. If we got trade protection, those pirates could be pesky annoying. What are these? Why does the AI always just have individual ships? It's not, f not as a fleet. Uh, we've got the goods to support them, so that will be fine. I mean, look at Anaxis, I'm like, the, Anaxis still has the criminal underworld, fair enough. Fair enough. Good. Droid assembly factories, garrisons. Credits for information, sure. Heavy vehicles, factory. If it's a bar more, they're watching it. If I wait, more vehicle. Pop. Asian Asian modifier. Let them feed our power sources. Attack the un Activate the universal translator. Greatest minus population growth seed. I can't have them risking doing anything against the Empire. So they must be dealt with, unfortunately. Research completed. Hyperfuel industry, a specialization called me helps points. We'll get Kyber mines going. Let's get Kyber mines going. Okay, so we're still in a bad situation, sort of here. So. Our hyperfuel is now dramatically increased, so. Should be ready for more ships soon. Constructing. Okay, early class Imperial destroyer here, might as well. Still disloyal. Integration shall start shortly, I believe. I think when I start that, then everything's gonna tank with resources and that, so we'll probably have to sell a lot of their ships and that, depending on what's on their planets as well. Incoming communication Udab command. Udab Udab. 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 
weird that the Kingdom of Zeltros has another world over here, which is strange to me. So just something they had already. Not sure what the transitory mists have. But I'm also thinking about trying to declare war on Mandalore forces. They sort of stand alone. Although they have independence guaranteed, so I believe declaring war will bring Alderaan in. So, we have a lot of forces on our side now, though. A lot would have to be dragged in, so... is still low hmm I think for an axis research completed I don't think any other planet I have in the area is uh, oh, oh no in Delhi has the stuff okay what's up now the server that have can fit some of our mining equipment is trying to in between it and our surface world they have damaged our unleashing chaos is not as much of the snakes god this is just really going bad for us, I feel like. One more equipment for repairs. This is what happens when you don't use enough fire. <laughs> Doesn't it already have growth speed? So... <sighs> Bloody Balmora's troubles. Imperial scientists have new advancements to show us. Or was it that was just research? Was it the shield generator anyway? Oh, hang on. I was taking a look at that, sorry. Uh, we'll go for a fire control. Is that another tar blocker I need, I think? Yep. Maximum trading ming. No defensive army health. No, I don't want that yet. Go for this tile blocker, seeing as some worlds still have that. Oh, my scientist was doing the excavation here. Forces here, is it? Thirteen K, Jesus, must be. Send a ship nearby, see what they really are. Maybe if I move the tile blockers, people might get. Happier. I don't know. I don't know what to do about Typhon. There is no option to change anything. It is bad for us in that case. Serpents are now using much to travel freely between their systems. A scientist said that they have scrolls on the symbol. Hmm. Okay then. That'll do for now. That's a population now. Increase the things. Ammunition in that seems to be alright actually. Maybe I should start building some ammunition stuff. For war. More for war. And I 
wish I could just make this vassal into something that's a oh the Pantoran assembly sure. Research completed. Nice. Got some more res more forces uh, income and that. Faction unity bonus spice mines. Oh, a spice mine might be thingy. Good. What building that gives me. Have we got our first star to show right there. scientists have new advancements to show us. Kyber mines are now fully operational. Get some increased mining station output, I feel like we might need it. Did I have my Star Destroyer online? Yes it is, it's there. Nice in there with my um uh Venators online now. It looks quite good with this fleet actually. I kinda like the look of this fleet now. God damn that sun. <laughs> oh wow, that's a uh, good. I wonder if there's a thing that we can upgrade our Venators to normal Star Destroyers, or maybe we should just leave them as they are, perhaps. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how things play out, but uh, it's a good, f that's a, yeah, it's good. Everything's all good. What the hell? Back where you are. Strange. Okay. The situation on Typhon is just my most pressing concern, but I can't do anything about it. I've got nothing, there is nothing that can increase stability, is there? Hmm, no. I mean, crime and amenities are still in the positive, so... God damn it, just such a regret on that, honestly. That's why I was, why did it have to happen right in the middle of a bloody war? When it cost my phone, can I wonder if the servants have been waiting for a ship to enter their system somewhere for a good land on. It's now full of destroyed. Boy, we're going down a lot of car. Venture forth into the cosmos. One can I help but wonder what their ultimate fate would be. If they get off my world, then that's fine by me. Better not be a thing where they just take cool or something. That would annoy the hell out of me. <laughs> I still don't know if we should have these ships into different fleets now. Right. Now, how goes our operations here? Deplete uh, equipment. I've left about what? So long, serpents. Well, they're gone. Fine by me. We don't have to deal with that anymore. Evolving in then, right. Her sleeper cell. Start by gathering information, it's just the lowest thing. I was hoping they just won't get caught. I think, were, they, were they not already gathering things? The Rodian clans, that's why. Alright, we're close by. What's, it? What's going on over Camino? What are these forces? Pirate forces, is that it? 
It's just a small pyro flea, fair enough. To show us. <sighs> uh, we will go for our... Keep down. There's just one small pyro flea over Camino, fair enough. I just I thought it would be the station or something, but yeah. Great, a kyber mine. I can well start doing that, but I don't know what else it will be able to do for us. Garrison does. Hang on, does the garrison produce stability? It does look like it. Can only have one anyway. But if that planet falls, then it may have a serious problem, but we'll see. It would have been bad if I had left it to this sort of time now, actually. Obviously, we can get more pre houses as well to help with stability. That might be something to look for. Yeah, we, can, we can get an actual thing here now, that's cool. Yeah, let's do that. So now, okay. Now that situation has been dealt with, we now need to start focusing on getting more space stations out for defenses and that. Or when we go to war on Corellia, these guys will attack us too, so... But they can come at us from any direction. That's the issue, there's no real way to defend ourselves from all or on. So, yeah, that's unfortunate. I can get a star base here, actually. Research complete. In case anybody comes attacking from this sector. We'll have that under control. Uh, let's start going into co-breaking. See if we can do anything that we can disrupt our, the forces of Corellia and Order on before we do any sorts of assaults. I just need to somehow disrupt their alliance somehow. Somehow. What about these remnants? And they're, they're under protection from the huts, so... Again, that is also bad, so... <laughs> these guys are neutral. Non-aggression, so... We don't have to worry about them. Good mission accomplished. Do have some more intelligence at least? Let's see if we can spark a diplomatic incident then. These guys are still receptive, so there's not much else we can do unless I get an envoy to improve their relations. I don't think I. If we can improve their relations, then get them into the fold. Don't really need sort of a thing. We're kind of monitoring these guys, they're just not bad. They will not stand well against us, so. Commons Guild, I believe. Are they under protection from anyone? Oh, hang on, I think we can demand their vassalization. But they... Well, they have independence guaranteed from there, so... 
I'm not sure, but first things first. Um, okay, what will be our next thing to acquire? Might monthly food habitability? No, uh, we don't need that ability. This be about trade. Kind of has been fine at the moment, to be honest. So that's fine. Diplomacy is not for the Empire. Um, encryptions, co-breaking, infiltrations and that, and possibly. Subterfuge may be a good one. Prosperity is... Uh, oh, diplomacy gives me more envoys. So... That might be also one. Well, that one gives us an additional envoy actually, so that might be a good one. Subject tax. Moth Council, possibly as well. We still haven't done anything for research. I thought I was going to get that, but I guess not. Ship build speed. Oh, that might be useful. We do have quite a lot. We still have four, I think. We might go for like maybe these three plus that. Four, possibly. So many choices now. It's yeah. <laughs> the new order of the Galactic Empire. Building slots as well would give me that. This I think this one might be just a good traditional one to have anyway. I will go for this one then first. Because I think that's just a good all-arounder, actually. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah, I think we can bring these guys, demand vassalization from these guys now. Join us. Or Our perish. Have completed that assignment. Have a tower blocker, I'll take that. Good. Good. Disloyal are they? Oh, they best keep in line. Constructing. Constructing. Okay, we'll get this up and running. Constructing. A synthetic hyper. Oh, we, then we can get more hyper fuel. There, that's not bad actually. Well, the Commons Guild has now come into fold. Another faction loyal to the Emperor himself. Soon the Zebrak Council, once the thing is up, will also form into an alliance with us, I believe. Now, stability has somewhat increased. Not by much that I would have liked, unfortunately, but... have one more pre-dinged house. I have to be careful because if they revolt they'll have a huge garrison to protect themselves. So being cautious of that. I think what I'll do is have a oh a most irritating envoy. So I think what I was going to do is that we'll upgrade this station, our car, because I think this one is going to be a good all-rounder for against like Alderaan. Maybe Corellia if we get attacked from that direction. Possibly, I think. 
I won't probably increase it by that much to be fair because if I can capture these worlds I'll probably have the station a new defensive station for Corellia itself Research completed. seek any source of targets we can get try and crack them try and dissolve their alliance if possible Research completed. Oh, we can get dark troopers. Oh, hell yeah. The most advanced dark troopers. God damn. But this one gives us more tier 4 armor specialization. Not sure what that means. But it gives me more things to unlock, so. But dark troopers are close to the field, which is interesting. Okay, we've got some unemployment going. We've not got the thing that can upgrade our pre-dinked houses. I could have sworn that could have been a thing as well. Also got back to refineries going up now. So whatever the back to gives us will be useful. Uh, An Imperial shipyard is under attack. More pirates. Of course they are. Of course there is. I'll get some ammunition stuff going, because I feel I will need it. Electronic components is kind of doing alright actually. Have the one, because the banner gas is not doing too well actually, so... Where is the pirates? Right where I'm building my station! Right where I'm upgrading it. It might do it before actually it uh, gets there. Our builders have completed that assignment. It's hard to tell if that would do it though, but reinforcements are on its way. I feel like these ships move fast for Stellaris. I don't know. <laughs> Imperial scientists have new but right as I was building my damn station, it's when they attack, of course. Increase naval capacity, sure. Uh, good, keep digging, keep digging. I've not been caught yet, so that's kind of good. But they still managed to... Mm, pirates. Course approved. We have lost a mining station. We have lost a mining station. That is such an annoyance. Imperial starships have engaged the enemy. God, a destroyer in combat at last. Operative spooked. By having taken every precaution in their training, has raised concerns that the cover may be blown. This comes a critical time for. <sighs> Infiltration level changes by minus 10. Have your resources then. Uh, 
As that lot of forces they have. Consider this station destroyed, Commander. Good. If that dealt with, get them back up to heal. Full strength. Our builders have completed their assignment. Right as I was getting that up. Just looking for anything that can disrupt them. I think it's about time to colonize this world, I think. Well, the worlds like that, they're all ruined worlds, aren't they? So, yeah. So I don't really want to get colonize them if they're all like ruined. Just don't need to try and get them back up and full speed type thing. We still also need to pre prepare for their integration. Stability is still fine here, so that's good news. We're going okay. to need maintenance after this. You know, I might as well start getting up like research stuff for anything that's sort of missing. A duro worker, of course. Have I not got a thing for that? But yeah, I'm gonna start getting up some researching housings plus some more houses as available for some of these is it just the duros now that I have to give better rights to <laughs> possibly I don't know Goes the operation here. Was it a success? Uh, they were not able to find a suitable target. What? Tom. They have nothing. Really? <laughs> Imperial scientists have new advancements to show us. No diplomatic thing anyway. Well, I think we can now do this smear campaign now. Which will hopefully we don't have any sort of way to increase it. Do we? We'll give it a try now. Hopefully it won't backfire on us. So, I'm hoping by that time, can, that can disangle the relations between them. And once that's ready, we'll claim territory. Actually, should we just start claiming territories now? Corellia is the planet that I definitely want the most. Should we? Or how much would it cost for me to claim all their territory? How much influence? So it would be 520 for all of their territory. Wow. I don't think I have to claim all their territories. I just have to... I would just have to claim the habitable worlds, wouldn't I? Actually. If we were to knock them out, I don't think I need to claim any of their stuff. I just need to claim their planets planets themselves right galactic peace shall soon spread to a new world yeah, we'll have this station colonized now our builders have completed that because assignment. I might as well Oh, 
form my defensive pact with them. Hopefully from that they will be good. Soon we'll have them defended. These guys is going to be ones that I will declare war on, but unfortunately their defensive packs does not suit well for us. Okay, we get our resources back here. I can do about um, Typhon then. Done all I can to increase the stability. But it's not much. I think there's no other way to increase it. I don't believe. This drought. Climb on an axis is a failed drought. They'll have to fend for themselves. Now we shall we attend to our civilians of the Empire. We we help them. Find an asteroid a specific fire at a specified empire. What? Hammer station? What why would Okay, I don't think I want to use the Another scientist lost. Normally research leader course, we'll just get that one then for the time being. Nothing at the moment, please. Rendelli can be upgraded, so that's good news. Same with Corvalog. these empires they've got for both hang on a second before we pause 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 we want to make sure that they've only got defensive packs with the boffin clans so target the boffin clans see if we can disrupt them if we can and we can start our wars on them We're just waiting now. Waiting for our wars. Constructing. Weapon range. Increase the weapon range. Can hmm. What defenses can we get then? Just defensive satellites. How do we build our latest construction project? Is finished. I could have sworn we could have built golems. Our spy master reports for plastic car failure. Great. Word from the Korean capital is has chosen to defect. Despite the fact we are supposed to be able to screen out such disloyalty, has been turned. If they have a spy network on us. If they're superior to our encryption, they can't be. Do, you really, do we really think they have a spy network thing against us? That's just the risk we're taking here. Their fleet power is growing to be equivalent. Now that's going to be an issue. We take the chance. And we must build up more ships.
more ships is going to be required now. If, we're, if we have any of our chance for war, their when power now is equivalent. Our latest construction project is finished. Alright, I've got to start rebuilding our forces now. We have a 69, so... Get another batch of Imperial ships. We've received a transmission. We shall route it to you at your request. If they wish, then so be it. Can we do also anything to try and increase hyperfuel? I'm pretty certain I've got one up everywhere that I can build. Oh, no, not here. That's fantastic. Uh, I've got a hyperfuel thing here. I believe there's only one per planet. Dover Court has it as well. Let me double check, make sure that it is everywhere. Coruscant has it. Hespinel has it. Vandal is building its own. That, that plus got it. Coralog has it. I thought I just paused. I think every planet has hyperfuel set up. Oh, Biss doesn't, but Biss has not increased yet. Has it? Oh, we can get it for Biss. Good. Typhon. I'm not a f Typhon's just not great. <laughs> so. Hmm. Um, can't build it yet over Balmora. So, but soon. Soon we will. We need the planetary administration. So, maybe I should just resettle some populations to this planet. Do we have, like, spare jobs available? Well, Coruscant has spare jobs. Dave Accor is, I believe, what I'm sending it next to, so... But I think I'll wait until the thing is back up and running. I'll wait until, yeah, the um, district there is up. Starbase main shield generator, hyperdrive, colony development speed... I still I am still paused. Okay, I was wondering why nothing was happening. <laughs> Research completed. We've received a transmission. We shall route it to you at your request. Good. Keep the Zabrak Council going up. I wish for their allegiance with us. Increase missiles. Make everything we got strong. Good, this Abrite Council is going well with us. Another useful ally for the Empire. We'll be close to finishing our... Well, I say close, but mid-game, uh, early game, we'll be finishing up soon. So... Once our city district is up, I'll move the other population over, get that up, and then we can get the hyperfuel for Balmora. Everywhere else seems to be sort of doing alright, although, be it some unemployment. May do something about that with the electronic component stuff, actually. What would it cost for me to use those? Uh, minerals and alloys, actually. Ok, 
caja. So maybe I might start doing that as well. Because that's costs for Our ships to be built to. Or maybe ammunition. Actually. Maybe do maybe we why not do both actually? Some planets. For some planets, yeah. Start getting some ammunition and that up. Please tell me that there was some pacifism loyal. If we can just disrupt them, we can begin our assault. But yeah, their forces have grown exponentially. Jesus Christ, I don't know why they don't group up with their whole fleets together. They've got bloody lucre hogs. Look at their fleet. Singular ships, so I don't know if that's... I don't think that's any better. Like for Luca Hulk class cruisers. I can't tell how powerful their group is just because it's all in singular ships, so but I'd imagine it'd be quite strong against us. It's difficult to tell. Volteron, I don't believe, is anywhere near as strong. Again, their forces are on their own. <sighs> Contact is lost. We can't even bloody... It's greater or equal to 10, so we can't even... ...do that. Uh... Silently cancel this operation and the unspent assets will not be consumed. I can't even retry it. Operations had to be cancelled. Really? I mean, the difficulty is hell, but... Just bad rolls. Unfortunately, we could not do anything to do it this time. Incoming Damn. communication command. Udar Stativ. Imperial forces have claimed a new planet. I am disappointed. Very disappointed about that. We cannot allow the Boffin clans to be allied with them. There must be a way to disrupt them. situation at Typhon appears to be sort of stabilizing actually. It's not at risk of being overrun. That is good news. Very good news. The retreat has been sounded. Wait well why was the retreat forced back? Oh because of ships a science ship is in danger, Commander. Why is it moving towards them? 
Because of course it was. <laughs> Not having an extra envoy will assist us. Try another smear campaign at another time. Hopefully, we'll be able to disrupt their allies, the allies between them. If worst case scenarios comes to be, we'll just have to declare our war against them, with the Boffin clans pushing to assist. The Boffin clans are far away. Well, not quite. They would have to pass through Federation territory, which I'm not too fussed about. So maybe I might not hot bring them into the fold just yet. They might have to be a bare front for our next plan of these forces. I believe I only have to claim these two worlds. That of the older one, that and those of older one. See, the issue is as well is that Corellia is powerful. Oh, now it's inferior. Probably because my new ships are online. Yeah, this destroyer can come down to assist this fleet, sure. But, um, yeah, so... Actually, is that fleet commander as high as then? What is the fleet command? Oh, wow, so yeah, kind of, yeah. So these ships is a... Uh, oh, wait, what? War declaration. Oh, thank God, it's not against us. Against the Juvex sector. Research completed. We found an Inablis. We found a Nadir. We could have demanded their vassalization, but that will have to wait now until war is over. But them being weakened may prove as an opportunity for us. We may be able to vassalize them as well. Get them to comfort us, to assist us. Mm. Good opportunity that can provide for us. Okay, so the situation on Typhon is at least stabilized. For now. But we'll have to watch out. It can't grow under the circumstances that it's at, so. Yeah, I will wrap the video up for now while I move to a sort our next phase which is still against Corellia and Alderaan. Mandalore is on its own but I must secure the core worlds before we do anything else. These factions I believe can be against us if when we start our rebellion sort of phase so crisis I mean we're only at the first level of crisis I know the rebellion comes into place sometime so we have to make sure that we are protected when all this happens. That I might as well start upgrading at least. I've got quite a lot of shipyards, so I might just leave that one up and running, to be honest. So, but yeah, these guys are now in the fold, at least. So, when it comes to it, and we do declare our next war, we will be ready. But for the time being, our forces must build up. At least this fleet is up and running together. Got an actual destroyer now, so that's good news for us. So yeah. But yeah, that'll be we'll have to just let things play out for the time being. If I can run a never successful operations operational smear campaign then perhaps, but it's still too risky. Research completed. We might have to do some more researching it to try and to uh, better it, but I won't know how, so. I'm going to wrap things up here while I'm pretty much in the phase of just building up forces for the next assaults here. I'll see you guys in the next video where hopefully, who knows what will happen, but we'll be one step closer to securing at least the core of the galaxy. May the force be with you. Goodbye.